My name is Amira and I'm addicted to baby ears. <laughs> gentlemen and everybody in between I'm back with somebody else's hair and guess what it is wine and wig stay clink 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 mmm girl mm, what for water it just don't got the same zhuzh when I'm drinking Deer Park versus a Chardonnay like what are we doing but y'all know what this means I did too much so I'm drinking water Y'all tell me what you're drinking down below. I'm talking about this water, but I need to be talking about these wet and wavy hair. I tried to transition that. I don't think that worked. Y'all see this hair on my head? Whose scalp is this? It's mine. It's my scalp. This looks like my scalp. This looks like my hair. You can't tell me any different. This is very much vacation hair. I need to be on vacation. I don't need to be in the middle of Atlanta. <laughs> you see that? And I didn't have to do no customizing. All I had to do was put her on right. Before we get into this hair though, can you please subscribe and can you hit the post notification bell just so you can see every single time I post, I'm gonna be coming to you at least twice a week with new fun wig teams. I know if you here, you like wigs. So just subscribe girl, I'll be here when there ain't nothing else to do and YouTube is dry. Let's go ahead and get into the details on this wig. So again, I wanna say thank you to XRS Beauty Hair for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. This always has to go with the thing. This, okay, this is a long one. So whew, I'm gonna take a deep breath and see if I can say it all in one swoop. It's the 13 by six clear lace, layered edge, wet and wavy, three in one lace wig. All of that for one wig, girl. It is 150% density and it is 18 inches long. Well, it was, I cut it. Cause y'all know, you put some scissors in my hands, I'm gonna cut something, stay away from me. If you pop the hood on the wig, you can see as far as the cap construction on the wig, like I said, it is a 13 by six lace frontal. Typically your lace frontals would be 13 by four, but they give you two extra inches of fun. Look, y'all get ready. We about to start parting. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Finally, you hit a track. Like what? Inside of the cap, you have four sliding combs and adjustable straps in the back and they also provide you with, they give you like a clip-in adjustable strap as well. Once you receive your wig, you receive your wig in the XRS Beauty Hair box. It's a beautiful box. And inside of that box, of course you get your wig and they also provide you with gifts. Gifts that they provide are wig caps, obviously, a wide tooth comb, a baby hair brush, some rollers, and the elastic bands that you can use to um, secure your wig. Along with the gifts, you also, of course, you get your wig, girl, you bought it. What I noticed when I pulled the wig right out of the box first is that the hair has a beautiful texture. Also, that this hairline is pre-bleached, pre-plucked, and ready to be worn. They describe this hairline as a layered edge hairline, so it just looks like, girl, it looked like this. Also, I noticed that this lace, she a little bit different from the regular lace that you see on other wigs. Of course, this is a clear lace wig. What does that mean? It's the new girl on the block. She's making fetch happen. Clear lace is different from the other lace that we're used to. So there's a whole bunch of different types of laces out there, girl. Main types are the brown lace, the transparent lace, as well as your new girl on the block, the clear lace. The brown lace is what we're usually used to. Brown lace is that girl, you know, she's supposed to match your skin tone, but everybody's not the same shade of brown. So I usually find brown lace sometimes works, sometimes it doesn't. Now you have your transparent lace. Now I don't like her. <laughs> transparent lace is supposed to be transparent, but it's only transparent, it seems to me, on certain skin tones. I've tried transparent lace before. She didn't work for me. She was giving me very much halo, go home to glory. But the clear lace girly, that's my girl. I've tried XRS Beauty Harris Clear Lace, and the great thing about clear lace is that for me, it matched my skin tone and it melted into my skin without me having to tint the lace or do too much to it. Clear Lace is what Transparent Lace wishes she was. Clear Lace 
works for me and my skin tone. Y'all let me know down below if you try Clear Lace, what you think, does it work for your skin tone as well? So when it got to actually applying this wig, I was so excited because I know I didn't have to do anything. And the great thing about this XRS Beauty Hair wig is that they are claiming that it is a three in one wig. So you're able to wear it straight, you're able to wear it curly, and it's supposed to revert back to straight without even damaging the hair. You get to see it straight, you get to see it curly, you get to see me apply the wig, and you get to see me apply this wig without the ball cap method because clear lace will always tell your teeth. But I found a way to make it not show up. Don't get too close though. If you wanna see how I applied this wig, how this wig looks straight, how we got it curly, the full transition, please keep on watching and I'll be back at the very end with my final thoughts and a coupon. Let's get into applying this wig. So y'all already know that when I do my base, I don't like to do the ball cap method, but this is a clear lace wig. You can see it. You can see all the way down to your thoughts, okay? Since this is a clear lace wig, we have to be careful with our base. Now for me, I don't care. <laughs> we just gonna put on the wig, child. We just gonna create our base. Now I do have to be careful. I'm gonna try my best to mimic the ball cap method without having to do it because I'm lazy. I'm just not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. So I'm gonna use the wig caps that they provided to me. Ooh, look at that nice brown. Let's go ahead and toss this one on. Nothing like a brand new wig cap to give you a headache. I can already see that this wig cap is gonna give me the business. So I'm just gonna start right now by coloring this wig cap in just to make it a little bit closer to my skin tone. Um, the one that works for me is this concealer. This is the Insta Age Rewind Concealer from Maybelline. And all we're gonna do is just color her in. You see that? So we're just gonna color her in. Uh-oh. Did I tell you what color this is? This is in the color Deep Bronze. That is a lot closer to my skin tone. Don't you think? Do you think it's closer? I think it's closer. Ball cap method achieved. It's been unlocked. Let's move on to the next step, which is putting on the wig, trying on the wig. I'm going to show y'all what she looks like because baby. Friend, you see that? Oh my God, that looks so good. Oh my God, I just love it so much. Let me not get off track because what I notice is that I be... I'm about to do it right now. My ADD be like tch, 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 tch. The next step is customizing this hairline. Typically I will pluck, but who needs to pluck this hairline? Y'all see this? I don't have to pluck anything. So since that's already done, all I have to do is flatten the hairline. So in order to keep it straight, I'm just gonna use the wax stick. I mean, this really doesn't have to even be flattened that much. We can just leave it be, but y'all know how I am. I ain't got no sense. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of wax stick. Did I tell y'all what this is? This is a ZLA Hairline Master Wax Stick. I've had it for so long and it's been lasting for so long. Just gonna add a little bit up here as well. Girl, we're done. Just add a little bit of wax and then we're gonna use our Andis hot comb just to go ahead and flatten her backwards. We have our Andis hot comb and we're just gonna go ahead and flatten the hairline backwards. First, I'm gonna pull this wig back because y'all know I don't play it by my forehead. You see how easily that flat iron backwards? Yes. Which side do you like better? This side or this side? I already know what's this side. I'm gonna keep flattening on this side. Let me pull this wig back and I'm gonna keep flattening. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I was just talking about how I'm not gonna burn myself and here I go. Y'all see this lace? You see how it looks, girl? All just a little flick of the wrist. We got a new hairline. Like, look at that. All we need to do is cut the lace. So there is a way to cut the lace to make sure it looks more seamless. I'm usually a straight across girl, but that makes your hairline look like a child drew it on. So I'm gonna take my scissors. I'm gonna start by cutting by the ear tabs and cutting above the ear and cutting that off. And then I'm gonna zigzag the hairline. So let's go ahead and get that out of the way.
Okay, so you can see that I did cut the lace. I gave it the little zigzag treatment. Next, we need to go ahead and apply the wig. Now, I haven't used this product before. Y'all know I love Wig Dealer. It's a black owned company. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply the wig. Now, I haven't used this product before. I hope it's really good. It's the Wig Dealer Touch Up Lace Bonding Gel. Y'all know I'm a gel girl. I'm not a glue girl because I'm trying to keep the edges that I have. And basically, it's like a, a silicone tip and you open it. Hold on, how do you open this? And then it releases the product. Let me squeeze it. Oh, you see? Oh, it's sticky. Oh, this is gonna be fun. It's gonna make it easier to apply this wig, which I'm excited about. So I'm just gonna use this and I'm just gonna apply. Oh my God, that's so much easier. I'm just gonna apply to my forehead. Oh my God, that's so easy. I'll leave a link for this product down below, but I'll see how it works first. I'll tell y'all how it is. Ooh, let's just wait till it gets tacky. Okay, so it's not completely dry, but it looks good though. Clear lace can be kind of weird to apply so you just be careful working sections clear lace is so soft like it just don't stick and it can get really really frustrating so be patient girl grab a drink if you need to if you're applying clear lace relax but in the meantime we're just gonna go ahead and keep applying the lace on the ear tabs and all the way down so I'm gonna start here Okay, so we're melting the hairline now. I'm telling you for right now, I am like almost in love with this stuff. My forehead is, you know, it's spit shiny. That's all right, we'll be able to wipe some of that off. Let's go ahead and layer some of this hair. Do I have sweat stains? Let me go ahead and take the hair down. Y'all know I don't know how to cut. I be acting like I know how to cut. I be in here, mm, 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 but I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> so I'm just gonna cut. Right at the chin. Oh, why'd I do that? Oh no. Okay, cut right at the chin. And here, I'm just gonna follow, follow this guiding piece and start there and then just layer downwards. This may not even turn out right, so don't listen to me. We'll see, if it turn out right, I know what I'm doing. If it don't, I don't. Okay, so let's... Y'all told me I need to do more angles, so. Yep. Yeah. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Do the same thing on this side. Ooh. 
we just need to get the ends. You see how, like, I don't like when my ends look like two legs. You know, like, what are, what are the sound effects for? Because I like it to look more blunt. It just looks better that way. So I'm just gonna cut it straight across on the bottom so it looks more thick. Oh, I need to get new shears. Okay, and then I'm gonna cut into it. Girl, I don't know. I think this is right. I'm a hairstylist. <laughs> is it even? Hold on, let me turn around. Is that even? Tell me the truth. <laughs> Say swa. If it's not, then oh well, girl, I don't know. Let me reveal the hairline. I wanna see what the hairline looking like. This is the big, oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh my God. Look at that. I probably did too much. I put a little bit of the touch up gel on top of the lace. I needed to get rid of some of that lace halo. If there's like a little bit of lifting, I'll get a little bit of a lace halo, but it looks good and I can't be bothered. But y'all know what my dilemma is now, right? To baby hair or not to baby hair? Y'all know I be wanting to do baby hair so much. <laughs> It's giving real, like I'm in love. Okay, so while I decide on the baby hairs, we can go ahead and straighten the hair. So I'm not gonna use heat protector today. I'm just gonna flat iron it. <laughs> Let me act like this is intentional instead of me being lazy. We're gonna see if this hair can really withstand heat. <laughs> so I'm just gonna do a little, you know, just a little quick straighten, like something quick. Oh girl, this is really looking like my real hair. I'm just gonna put up this side. And we're just gonna straighten the hair. Girl, I am hungry. So I need to hurry up and do this so I can eat some. So I'm straightening. Oh no, it already turned off, dang. Smart iron ain't too smart when it gets to me. It really be trying me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let this heat up. And then we're gonna go ahead and flat iron this hair. I'm just gonna do like a light, you know, like a little, you know, something like with a little bump. It's already, pretty straight and the texture feels like silk pressed out hair. So I'm just gonna, I wonder if one pass on a thick chunk of hair is gonna do it. Cause for a lazy girl like me, oh, this is too much hair. Girl, I tried it. Okay, wait, I'm doing this, ah, it's hot. I'm doing this wrong. Cause I kinda wanted to have like a little bump. Oh. Girl, I'm gonna keep doing it like this, big chunks, cause I don't have time, I'm hungry. So, But let's go ahead and move to the next chunk and I'm just gonna straighten all the hair all the way to the top doing big chunks, lazy boots. That's what they call me.
so this is like what the hair looks like straight. It's super pretty. Like, ugh. So we're gonna, just gonna do light baby hairs in the front. Oh, oh, ooh. Very light baby hairs. And y'all know how I do my baby hairs. It's always in the same area of the head. But I think this is good. Like, that's fine. I'm just gonna cut this down. And then, why am I not moving my head? I'm scared I'm gonna lose these little baby hairs. They gave us a baby hair brush. I always need baby hair brushes. I have about 20 of them and they're all dirty. I can't find my gel and I promise you it's tequila brand. It's probably right in front of my face. Thank God, I always got multiple hair products. So I'm gonna use the Got To Be Glue gel to lay down my baby hair because my ORS olive oil gel is currently missing. She's on the run. So we're gonna use the Got To Be Glue gel. It works just as well. So, oh God. And Y'all know what the time it is. It's time to swoop. Swoop. That's cute though. Okay, so it was like a little mistake at first, but now <laughs> that's cute. That's like little baby hairs, but like not really. Y'all see that? I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side and on the ear tabs. We're gonna do like light, natural looking baby hairs. Look at that baby hair. <sighs> My name is Amira and I'm addicted to baby hairs. <laughs> Keep going, sis. Hey y'all, see? Oh, girl, it's got I got the ash. But y'all see how it looks? This is the finished look with the hair straight. I had to throw on some makeup because you know I had to take pictures in this look. Look how pretty this hair is. It's super soft, super bouncy, really, really light, and it feels like my natural, like my natural hair when I've straightened it. But this is what it looks like, so pretty. Oh girl, what was I doing with that makeup? Who, 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 what are we doing here? <laughs> Look at how pretty this hair is. I curled this hair uh, some hours ago. She still is curled up very well. And the hairline, giving, giving. I don't even want to go curly with this hair because it looks so good straight, but we have to go curly. I wanna see how she looks when we go curly. I know it's gonna be cute because it looks so good right now. Okay, so we're about to go curly. Y'all know, when it's time to go curly, I, we gonna have to use my favorite product. Where's the full bottle? Ooh, girl, I was about to panic. This is the Coconut Hibiscus Freeze Free Curl Mousse. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this mousse and where's my denim? And this brush, this is an Denman brush. This is like a Finman brush. It's a fake Denman, girl. This is like the Evolve 572 brush. I told y'all about her. She's real old. I've had her for some years, but it does a great job of clumping up your curls. So I'm gonna be using this with this, using them together to create the curls that we need to get this wig looking good. So let's go ahead and get into it. Let's start by adding the mousse to the hair, so. So I'm really sad though. So I'm gonna work in sections, trying to get the curls on this wig going. So I'm gonna work in large sections, not small sections, because girl, who has the time? I'm gonna work in sections like this size. Like, look how pretty this is. 
So we're gonna add the Shea Moisture Mousse. I'm gonna show y'all how, they said that the hair should curl up in two minutes. So we're at, oh, it's so soft. Oh my God. Brush it and then scrunch it. And I'm just gonna work it all the way through before, until we get to the end. Uh oh, here it comes. There you go. Come on. We're gonna let it curl on its own and then I'll show you the end result and what the hair looks like once it's curly. Okay, so this is what the hair looks like after adding the mousse to it and when it's wet. So we need to go ahead and get her dry because I want to see what these curls look like because right now it's giving very much water wave. Where the curls at though? But I want to see like once it dries, what is it going to give? So I'm just going to go ahead and diffuse the hair. So y'all already know, I love this diffuser. Got her from Target. She $15. $15. I'm going to see if I can quickly get her dry so we can go ahead and get her done. So we can see what the end result looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and dry it with this diffuser on high and cool. Girl, whatever's gonna get it dry as quickly as possible because I'm hungry. Okay, y'all, this is the finished curly look. Look at this. It's so pretty. This is not what I expected it to look like. Gotta be honest with you. I thought it was going to give something like curlier, but this is more like a like deep wave sort of look. And I'm here for it. Take me to Miami, girl. Take me to somebody's beach. I'm ready to be out. And that hairline, I'm sorry, you can't tell me that this ain't my hairline. I don't care, I don't care. We got a little, a little lick spit shine right there. You would just say sweat, I'm hot. <laughs> the way that they finesse this hairline, I'm telling you, XRS Beauty Hair, the clear lace, yes ma'am. Now I'm not sure how the hair looks in the back. Don't blame me, I can't see the back of my head, but look, this is what it looks like in the back. Do it look crazy? It probably look crazy. It is gorgeous. It gives like, it almost looks like wet. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's not wet right now. It's finally dry. It took some time for it to dry cause I put a lot of product in it, but it looks like, it looks wet, but it's not. Oh, I can't wait to wear this wig on vacation. Y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing. Don't say nothing to me. You can kind of see the wig cap right here, but like, mm, mm, mm. is that a big deal? No, it's not. <laughs> now, as far as the clear lace, I think it's a lot better than I've tried it before. Now, if you have a deeper skin tone, I'm wondering if you've tried Clear Lace, you can leave it down below. Let us know how it works for you. Using this stuff 
on clear lace, everything. I love how it looks. I love how it turned out. Oh my God, my allergies. And I wanna say thank you again to XRS Beauty Hair for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. I will leave links for everything I used in this video, um, including the wig, obviously. I'll have links for the wig down below, but I also am gonna have a coupon. If you would like to get 15% off your wig purchase, you can use the coupon code that I've listed down below. Go ahead and check it out. Get some money off. Save your money. I'm feeling like for Clint, what's going on? I wanna say thank y'all so, 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 so much for watching. I love you all and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.